In hacking world, we often use Kali Linux word. What is Kali? How hacker use Kali for hacking? In this video, I am going to tell you everything about Kali Linux and tell you how to install it on USB drive with encrypted persistence. Before we begin, I want to announce that I am going to start teaching hacking using Kali Linux in my upcoming videos. I will cover all hacking topics right from the beginning. So if you want to make career in hacking or you just want to learn hacking as a hobby, then this is the right destination for you. But everything comes with a price. So bad news is I will start posting hacking videos only if we complete 1000 subscribers target. So if you haven't subscribed our channel yet, then go ahead and subscribe it and share it so that you can start learning hacking as soon as possible. So without wasting more time, let's begin this video. What is Kali Linux? Kali Linux is a Debian based Linux distribution that is maintained by Offensive Security. Kali Linux is mainly used for advanced penetration testing and security auditing. Kali contains several hundred tools which are geared towards various information security tasks such as penetration testing, security research, computer forensics and reverse engineering. Now you are wondering why should we use Kali Linux for hacking? If you are interested in penetration testing or cyber security stuff, you need some specific tools to perform some tasks which come pre-installed and settled up in Kali Linux. So you may directly use them without using any configuration. Or in case if one wants to check the vulnerabilities on a website or want to know security related bugs in any application, then it is great to go with Kali Linux. Many people think that Kali is a tool for hacking or cracking social media accounts or web server. This is one of the biggest myths about Kali Linux. Kali Linux is just another Debian distribution with a bunch of networking and security tools. It is a weapon to train or defend yourself not to attack anyone. Kali Linux was designed mainly for professionals. It is for those who want to get their hands in penetration testing, cyber security or ethical hacking. This is a powerful tool in case if you don't use it properly, it may lead to losses even. Now we are going to install Kali Linux on USB stick with around 7 GB of encrypted persistence. For doing this, you should have at least 16 GB pen drive and a computer system. Now follow all steps that I am going to show you.